our newest handicapper, the mailman delivers winners. Does he stay undefeated? Two guys have very, very big days. We do have our Thanksgiving turkey of the day. And who would that be? The biggest party night of the year, and Mr. Iverson misses practice on Thursday. Hmm, wonder why. What's that saying? A leopard doesn't change his spots? All that and more. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Parlay Help starts next. Well, how much football did you watch yesterday? I know, I was watching it from just about 12 in the afternoon, almost 12 at night. And I can't figure this Eagles team out. I just can't. It is the strangest thing, but that West Coast jinx does hold true. What about Mr. Iverson? This is practice Thursday. I can't wait to see that fine. And why do you think he missed it? Remember that video I was telling you about, have it had off on the biggest party night of the year, and I finally did? Well, apparently Mr. Iverson decided he wasn't going to take off either. And Thanksgiving's finally done. You're home. It's time to relax. How about a little live chat tonight? Thinking about doing it. Check your emails, because if we do it, you will get an email. But enough about that. Let's get to who did what and the plays. Our winner of the week, Top Shelf Chicago, continues to roll on. Goes 1-0 on the day, plus 20 units. He does have a winner of the week special. And this is our sixth time winner of the week. Not six in a row, but six time. Head on over to his site, click the banner above me or the link below me, and check out his special. Sharp Edge Plays, our bankroll winner of the week. Also has a special. 25% off all his plays. Head on over to his site. He goes 3-5 and five on the day, plus 720 bucks. Good money management. Betting as a business, 3-1 and one on the day, plus... 189 units. Bobby Clark Sports, 3 and 1 day plus 760 bucks. He did go 3 and 0 in the NFL, did all over/unders and nailed all three. The Basher, 1 and 0 on the day plus 200 times. Yes, he did release a 200 time play that drops him from the winner of the week competition. Millionaire Picks, 2 and 1 on the day plus 760 bucks. Pete James, Party Pete Sports, one in one on the day, plus seven dimes. How about Mr. Payne Insider? Continues, continues to roll this week. Three and O oh, plus 95.5 dimes. Primetime Sports Advisors, two and one, plus 24 units. Rock Hard Picks, three and O, oh, plus 159 dimes. Sports investing is a business, 3-0 and plus 300 units. The mailman delivers winners, was undefeated this week. Struggles a little bit, 1-2, and going to give back 50 dimes. He is giving out free plays all week because he is the newest capper on the site. Head on over there and you get yourself some free plays. You would have made some money this week. The Parlay King, 2-1 and plus 3,500 bucks. Had 2,000 di- buck plays. He's out of winner of the week, although he is not concerned. Tony Bruno wins. Told you, these guys are rolling. 1 0, plus 10 dimes. Ty Davis, sports investor, 7 and 5, plus 150 dimes. So, where do they stand? You can either click me off now or look at the chart below. Top shelf Chicago, 2 0 on the week, plus 40 units. Sharp edge plays, 8 and 7 on the week, plus 1,780 bucks. Betting as a business is 8 and 6 plus 249 units. Bobby Clark Sports, great week so far. 7 and 2 on the week plus 1,830 bucks. The Basher, 1 and 2 plus 35 dimes, not eligible for winner of the week, although he did nail the 200 dime play, so he must have had some good information on the game. Millionaire Picks, 2 and 1 plus 70, 760 bucks on the week. Pete James at Parley Pete Sports, 2 and 3 plus 6 dimes. Another example, said a thousand times, good money management. Paint Insider is just rolling along. 7 and 2 plus 139.5 dimes. Primetime Sports Advisors, 4 and 6 
They are down two units on the week. Rock Hard Picks is rolling this week. Nice job. 4-0 plus 195 dimes. Sports Investing is a business. 3-0 plus 300 units. Not winner of the week eligible. The Mailman Delivers. Winners, 5-2, plus 47.2 dimes. You can get free plays there. The Parlay King is 2-2, two two, plus 200, or 2,400 bucks. Not winner of the week eligible. Tony Bruno wins, 2-1, plus 49 dimes. Watch these guys this week, although Rock Hard Picks, doing quite well. Ty Davis, Sports Investor, 15-15, and 15, one push. He is down 150 dimes. Like I said, good, good chance we're going to do some chatting tonight in the chat room. It's been a while. I will email everyone if I decide to do it as well as post something on the site. But I'm definitely thinking about it. And what do you think about this new 16.9 view on YouTube? Not sure if I like it or not. It may go back to the 4.3. My email address, info at parlayhelp.com. Would love to hear from you. We are the number one sports monitor on the internet. We review each and every guy every day. Tell you about them, what's going on, how they're doing for the week. If they have a bad week, they're not going to get buried down on the bottom like some other monitors. And we are pretty much full at this point. Pretty much full. Ended up going with the Sweet 16. Not really because I wanted to, because I had to, because the economy is bad in the bar business industry. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving Black Friday report after all the games are over tonight. And you may see some live chatting. Check your emails. There's my cat. Wish I could turn the camera, but it would screw everything up. Partyhelp.com.